Hello, we have another box packing, two in one week. Can y'all believe it? Um, Monday, I packed up um, sweet little Gabriel, who was the Michaela sculpt, and he should actually be arriving home today, because today's Wednesday, and today I am packing up Haley Andrea to be going home, and um, so he should probably be home by Friday. So let's get to it. First, I'm going to pack up this... Um, this all-in-one, this is what I just changed him into in the last video I changed him. It's it's the white and navy blue striped long-sleeved uh, all-in-one romper. And it has a green, green around the collar and the ankles and the wrists. And then there's a patch on the front of this, a silhouette of a bear. And then embroidered in the patch it says, strong, tough little guy. Isn't that sweet? Let me actually get, there's a couple little pieces of my DNA. Let me get them off. <laughs> I'm always picking my hair off everything. You think it's winter, I wouldn't be shedding, but I still shed even in the winter. All right, I'm wrapping this in this beautiful purple tissue. Oh, I love this color. Let me grab a piece of ribbon. I hope everybody's having a great week. I'm actually... Um, going to try to make a video today, like a uh, regular video, where I, there's a couple tags I want to do, of course, you'll know that if I did or not already, before this goes up, <laughs> but anyway, I hope y'all are having a great, great week, um, it has been a good week here, but I tell you, I, f I feel like, like today should already be Friday, and tomorrow should be the weekend, but it's not, this is a little uh, short all by Little Me. It, it, oh, I forget what that other one brand was. This is white, and it has little uh, drawings in dark and light blue of little puppies. And they have kites and sailboats. Really, really sweet. That's going into a piece of bright yellow tissue. Um... I don't know, I just have been feeling this week like, I don't know if I'm doing too much in a day that I feel like the week should already be over, but I tell you, it's probably the weather. I don't know about where y'all are, but it is quite, quite cold here this week. But at least the sun is shining, so I'm grateful for that. But it has been crispy and... Um, Frosty in the morning. This is a little uh, sleeper that is by Petite Lem. It is red, gray, like a dark gray and white stripe. There's actually a little pocket on the front in light gray that has an embroidered uh, sailboat in dark gray. This looks like uh, almost like a pirate. Oh, it's a pirate ship. Anyway, it's a footed sleeper. Which will be so cozy for the approaching colder weather. This little man is actually going to be joining some girls that I created. He's actually joining a house full of babies. Uh, he is joining the the J crew. Hi, Jaleesa. But this is the first boy she's adopted from me. She has a few girls from me. So it'll be fun uh, to see a little boy in the J crew that was created here at Kimberly's Cocoon. I do know his name, but I will let his mommy announce it. Of course, you know it starts with J. <laughs> Here's a little side snap, a Old Navy long-sleeved uh, onesie shirt. It is white with gr uh, green circles, about probably about an inch, just all rows and rows of circles, and then the side snap portion has gray fabric. And this piece of tissue is kind of like a periwinkle color. Um, so yeah, I just hope everybody else is having a great week. And I'm just hoping my body adapts to winter quicker than it usually does. Like it's spring. Spring takes me a while because of allergies. Um, but winter is generally nicer because, you know, the cold than my allergies subside for a few months. Although I didn't have that luxury when I lived in Texas. I was allergic all year round to Texas. 
here's a little all-in-one, <clears throat> just one U. It is a dark slate gray, and it has little green frogs all over it. And then there's an embroidered froggy on the chest, and it has a little proper man collar. Super sweet. Y'all know I love frogs. Frogs and gray. Oh, what a combination. I love gray. Um, anyway, so yeah. So, I don't know if I'm, I'm trying to think if I've ever done two box packings in a week before. Maybe only once. But I'm not recalling whose they were. But I, I think I've only ever done this. Maybe this is the set. Or is this the first time? I think I've done two box packings in one week once before. But anyway. Alright, that is his clothes. Now, let me get his. He's going to go home with a gray, a light gray muslin blanket. Lay that there. Oops, I didn't get that correct. There we go. Come here, sweet little man. He's all cozy in the bumbo. Ooh, those thighs. He's very snuggly and cuddly, aren't you, little man, man? Yes, he is. All right, I'm going to dress him. Mm, there he is in his one-of-a-kind Kimberly's Cocoon onesie. Now, this outfit I never put on him, but I put it in his little going-home drawer. Oh, I didn't show him to y'all. I'm just being so selfish. There he is. Can you see his sweet face? There you are, little man-man. So this little onesie is striped. It is white with bright green, pale blue, and bright blue very thin little stripes. And it's short sleeved. I'll put that on him. It looks like it'll fit him, but like I said, I haven't tried it on him before. Um, when I pull a wardrobe for a baby, I y'all know I have all my you know stock clothes that I go through. And I generally like to pick a few outfits for the photo shoot. Because some of the stuff I use in my photo shoot belongs to me. Like it doesn't go home with babies. And then I like to keep a couple things, you know, to send home with the baby as a little surprise. So I pulled this outfit together. These little socks match. They're white socks. And they have a bright green, a dark blue, and a light blue stripe. So we'll put those on him to keep his feet toasty. And I paired it with these little, they're just plain gray, who are these, Cloud Island, little, I call these softy pants when I was a nanny. I never had children nap in their clothes, like the clothes we would go out of the house in. Uh, they would come back, I would always have them nap either in pajamas or softy, I call them softy pants, which are what these are. Um, they're super soft, they're just plain, you know, I I would not want to sleep in dungarees or anything with like blue jeans with snaps, etc., etc. That, mm -mm. so I always changed the children and babies into softy clothes. <laughs> Usually jammies, though. Probably about eighty percent of the time they napped in jammies, and then sometimes instead of jammies, I would just like if they were wearing a shirt that was. You know, but a lot of times, like the boys wore button down shirts and stuff, and girls would wear dresses. So, but every once in a while, if they just had like a comfortable shirt on, I would just switch them to softy pants. Anyway, and then there's a matching hat. The hat matches the shirt, it's the stripes. Let's see if this fits you, little man man. Oh, oh sorry, love. Ouch. Oh, it didn't even disturb his sleep. He must be having a great dream. Sorry, little man, man. I want to snap a photo because I've never seen him in that outfit. Now, I also have a little pair. I, I have quite a few of these. I always forget to send them home. So I had pulled these, but I don't think I'm going to put them on him. I think I'll just put them in one of his little organza bags that I have here, like with socks and stuff. I did this the other day with uh, Gabriel. I had put him in an outfit. It's not the best lighting for a photo, but... Since I haven't seen him in this before, I'm going to add these little middies to his, this organza bag that has, uh, 
has his another pair of socks for him. And that way he has them, but I don't want to put them on him to go home. Okay. There we go. Now, all right, I get a last snuggly buggly. Come here, little man man. I won't plunk your head again. Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, he's so snuggly. Oh, he is a cuddle bug for sure. Safe travels, little man. And give your sisters and your brothers. You have brothers too, but give them all big hugs from me. And of course your mommy. Give your mommy a hug. Jaleesa is so sweet, y'all. Okay, let's... Wrap. Oh, his lovey. He has an elephant lovey. There's his elephant lovey. We'll kind of snuggle him in there with you like that. How about that, little man-man? On a real baby, I'd make sure that was nice and flat. <laughs> You don't want to be uncomfortable. Have a big lump of fabric under your back. Oof, that would not be cozy. There we go. And here's, I've got to be careful because his name is on the back of his handmade with love. Let's see if I can do this. Oh, darn. My ribbon's up. So oh, let's see. Maybe if I do that. I always turn the ribbon around. Duh, I can just do that. Oh, Lord. Well, I figured it out a few years later. <laughs> How many times have I switched the ribbon instead of just flipping it that way? Oh, no. Oops. Here went his little It's a Boy rattle. Let's put that back on, y'all. Okay, here we go. Maybe. Okay. I keep wanting to say things, but I, I'm in my head. I'm like, if you're going to do an update video today, don't be doing that here because this is going to post in a couple days. There he is. Aww, little man, man. Now, let me just, the other day I moved the box over, but I think what I'm going to do is just move my tape and stuff. And all oh my accoutrement. Oh, his bubbly wrap. Okay, little man, here you go. All safe. Journey home. Ooh la la. Now I think. There we go. We're going to lay this young man in first. Okay, now. Just always have to be careful because the tripod, you know. I don't want to bump it. Okay, now let me put a couple packages up here at his head. And shimmy him up. There we go. And then I'll put a couple down here at his feet. Like so. Here's his bottle. He's getting a Winnie the Pooh bottle with candy inside and, of course, a little rubber ducky. And some diapers. There's a couple plain white ones from different companies. And then this one has Minnie and Mickey. And then there's a couple Honest diapers with baseball print. There we go. And then here, this bag is a blue organza bag. It has a pair of bright blue booties. These are from the lady I ordered. I did not make those. And then a white pair of socks and a light blue pair of mittens. And then this gray organza bag has his passy, a couple turtles for his pockets. Boys need things for their pockets. And a no Noni's No Hole Nipple to go in his bottle if mommy wants. And here's his book. It's called Piglet Meets a Heffalump. Ooh, oh, a heffalump. Remember the heffalumps and woozles? Let's lay this PKG. I think this one will fit down here, actually. It is softy and very pliable. Okay. Just, okay. Then I have a couple gifts for Mommy. I have a bar of Zum Soap grapefruit. It's in a plastic bag, so I can't smell it all that well. And then a EOS Shimmer Lip Balm in sheer pink. And then here's uh, his Kimberly's Cocoon hairbrush. Let's 
just lay that there. And then I got this cute little Ann Getty's puzzle for Mommy. It's a little baby in a flower pot. And the puzzle pieces are actually in a flower pot. I thought that was fun. And then here's a bib for him. It's white, and then it has navy blue anchors and red hearts on it. We'll lay that there. And here's his Kimberly's cocoon bag. And let's see, this is Mandarin Spice hand sanitizer. Again, for the mommy, not the baby. Okay, we'll lay that there. I'm just looking around to make sure I have everything. I think I do. Here's his folder, which of course has all the paperwork. COA, let's see, here's his COA. It's actually like on photo paper. Well, it is photo paper. Uh, number 253 of 1200. I thought that was a really cool COA. Um, care instructions, the poem, the story of the cross, photos, birth certificate, and a note to mommy. Okay, I think that's it. Oh, we forgot to put this stuff in. This is the end of my bag of fall leaves. Sprinkle some fall leaves. Are y'all's leaves changing and falling? I hope it's so beautiful, isn't it? And then I'm going to also put some little other fun fetti in here. Y'all know I love fun fetti. Oh, it just makes it more fun, doesn't it? Maybe it's just me. I don't know, but I like it. All right. Now, we're going to. Oops. Pop this little man in. I almost said his name. Okay. I think that's good. And we'll put his little sticker on top. There we go. All right, little man. Get my helper piece of tape. Uh, oops, maybe. Oh no, I destroyed my helper piece of tape. <laughs> I'm no help. Let's try that again. Redo. There we go. Then, his fun tape is little owls. Isn't that sweet? It's a blue, like a sky blue background, and then little brown owls sitting on tree branches, and then there's green leaves. Aww. Owls. Owls are beautiful. All right. All right, everybody, I'm going to put the address label and extra tape on after I sign off. But, Jaleesa, thank you so very much for adopting this sweet little man. I hope he brings you years of joy and love. Kiss all your other babies from me. Thank you, everybody, for stopping by, and have a blessed, blessed, I'll say weekend now, because this will probably air on Friday. Bye-bye, <laughs> everybody.